Welcome back. We now go to the business review where Dashan Hendricks looks at new plans at lithographic printers. 60 years and counting, lithographic printers not showing signs of aging, but making plans for another 60. The company which prints books, t-shirts, even a lot of tickets, and the Fosca Oaks box still going after new markets. Last week, a tour including the Commerce Minister, Audley Shaw, was organized to show off its latest machinery. We've completely diversified our business from printing and paper to offer signage solutions, um, t-shirt printing, and our newest and more substantial investment just coming online now, which will be labels on a roller. The total investment in that new machine, 500,000 US dollars, clients are already lining up. Most of these labels are being imported from other Caribbean regions, and we as a Jamaican-owned company wanted to be in the game and, and support local and be producing world-class quality locally. But like other manufacturers, Sean Kenny however, expresses concerns. He called for cheaper loans for producers. Interest rates have been falling, but are still in double digits. The Commerce Minister Orly Shaw responds. As far as I'm concerned, uh, we cannot have manufacturers asking for loans to at commercial banks and are required to pay 13, 14 and 15 percent for loans. Unacceptable. Even 10 percent in my view is unacceptable. Mr. Shaw says he also wants to take a look at the duties paid on imports for similar products made in Jamaica with a view to creating a structure to favor local manufacturing. He said that would entail a detailed review of the policies which are hostile to local producers. It includes finding a way to redirect some or all of the $1 billion being spent annually by the government to import textbooks to local printers. For Mr. Dukeni, that's music to the air. But he says it's not that easy. The publishers who write the book is really who controls the rights to where it's printed. I would like the government to try and get some locally published. Without, with, we have brilliant teachers that can write books, have it locally published, so then the government can then choose where to print it and can support the industry. Because we, as you can see, we are quite capable of producing it. For now, he concentrates on what he has control over, producing the products now being made in his company in downtown Kingston. Signage, labels, t-shirts, offset printing and digital printing. It is our hopes and goals with the new machine that we have, we will be able to enter the market as it is the same technology seen anywhere in the world. For the Business Review, I am Dashan Hendricks.